Hi Libra, I'm Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back my Cyber Angel and if you're new, welcome to the channel please subscribe and hit the bell on all then you'll be notified um, when I go live or when new videos are uploaded if you would like to have a one-on-one -on -one reading with me or, or an extended reading then please look at the information beneath this video in the description box or click on this link here the little white circle that will take you to the um, website and there you can find more information okay now um, uh, also is that uh, I'm really ecstatic and I'm happy and I know some of you that are follow me you'll be surprised I've only got three cards but trust me there are very long videos so if you if it gets boring then uh, stop it and then come back to it later and you can download it and take from it what you can if it doesn't resonate with you like I always say have a look at your moon sign and your sun sign all the decks are by Colin Baron Reed and I've got the animal spirit uh, spirit animal oracle deck I've got the wisdom of the hidden realms and the crystal deck which is the new deck you most probably have seen the review on this deck that I've made there you can f see all the st stones in their color and glory and I just love it and thank you very much my cyber angels for those that have given me a super sticker or a super chat previously and thank you this is what I've bought from the money that I've earned and I put it all back into the channel because I just want to keep it exciting and refreshing and fun and that is what the life is the tea room is gorgeous the cyber family I can't do without you I love you I really do I think you're magic and last night was really a magical session I give free cards but I also answer questions that's short readings and um, so long they are supported with a donation or and that is with a super sticker or a super chat so let's begin with your beautiful reading and you've got this scarab beetle well you know that the scarab beetle he is or she is uh, um, also um, 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 a magical um, symbol uh, the witches uh, have that he came also into our witches series but I'm going to stick with your reading uh, Libra so um, you've got number 52 so you've got seven so you've got luck on your side and the scarab beetle is a luck beetle okay so you've got two things confirming that you will have a lucky week this week magic magic works through you yes you are magical every one of us is magical but you are extra magical this week I'll put it here you can see it much better there you go now you might be as busy as a beetle because a beetle usually carries uh, uh, X percent um, of stuff uh, on his back and he's busy 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 with and he works well in groups so perhaps you can work well in groups wow anyway let's get into the message in ancient Egypt the scarab beetle was referred for the creative magic of scarab beetle spirit reminds us that we can bring forth something extraordinary seemingly out of thin air in other words you can make something new from something old that's magical in itself that's one one th way of looking at it and it's great fun whenever you let your creativity flow through you scarab beetle reminds you that spirit has given you the gift of infinite potential you have an ally as you fashion something new or repurpose the old the spirit co-creates with you channeling energy through you so that you feel replenished and vitalized as you make magic with what is at hand now is the time for great optimism for you can accomplish anything you desire and your creative endeavors will come to fruition Mir miracles opportunities abundance and love will appear seemingly out of nowhere as you allow spirit 
to work through you and magically manifest what you need. The protection message of the scarab beetle is do you doubt your unique inner magic? Are you afraid that you have no originality or that creative juices don't flow through you? Perhaps you mistakenly believe you are not the creative manifesting type. Scarab beetle spirit messages is message is that creativity is a living force that comes to all of us from spirit who wants every person on the planet to manifest magic and co-create the world anew. You are as capable of resilience and innovation as anyone. You can do what you have always done. You're going to get what you've always got. So draw inspiration into being, into your being and begin to playfully create something new and do it without any judgment. Creativity and magic are your legacy as an expression of the Creator. So let them flow through you. Wow, that's lovely. You've, so you've got luck on your side. You might be painting, you might be rebuilding or refurbishing your house or polishing your car, that or cutting the lawn so your garden will be beautiful and be will be refreshed and that is also creating, sorry, creating. That is creating something, doing something, okay. So go for it Libra, you can do it. Now you've got the resting tree, patience and stillness. Even in rest or meditation or contemplation, that's what this card means to me, you are creating something. You are creating rejuvenation. Think about it. In stillness and patience, you are creating something rejuvenation so you can start something anew. Okay, it's number 22 so you've got an angel number so you've got a proper foundation that is becomes a 4. Okay, 2 and 2 is 4. So that is your numerology. Productivity. Uh, proper foundation. So something that you're going to start creating will be there for a long while for you. The resting tree is a sign for you to stop focusing and planning and be at peace in the moment. Boom. This is your ally. This is when it comes in as your ally. This is a representative of non-action and relaxation. Patience is the key to being with this ally. The resting tree asks you to slow down, sit back and watch the rose, roses bloom and the birds feed in the meadow. This isn't the time to forge ahead in any way. You may not be taking enough breaks, so you are invited to be still and contemplate your good fortune, even if it means blessing the chaos in your life. This is a sign to allow everything to fall away, except the stillness of the moment. It's like living within the space between breaths. When the resting tree appears, it signals that you've done all you can for now, and it's time to unwind and allow your story to unfold of its own accord You've earned the right to rest and relax. Amazing ideas will come if you do. Remember the ancient saying, we do, without doing and everything gets done. The ancient, the scarab beetle is ancient. If he comes in as your challenger, challenger the resting tree appearing as a challenger ask you to consider if you are so frantic 
that all you can think about is how stressed you are running around and overdoing if anything only makes you into a human doing not a human being what sounds crazy running around and over doing anything only makes you into a human doing not a human being right okay it doesn't really sound kosher <laughs> Uh, I suppose so. It's like right the beetle running around. You have to. It's not human to, to keep on going on and on and on and on. You have to take rest. Because then you're a super being. You're not a human being. I think that's what they're trying to say here. This is a sign to be careful, or you may become physically ill, or at very least unable to enjoy your life. Be still. It's time to meditate and take time out or you will make some mistake that you may regret later don't worry all those things you are trying to manage will still be there when you are ready to move forward again only then will you have a clearer head with which to think like I said it looks like a meditative and contemplative card it's like the four of swords okay and the hermit so that uh, yeah this is your reading Libra but there might be a Virgo I've got a, f a feeling here there is something with a Virgo okay or an air sign an other air sign not only you okay you've got Labradorite Labradorite okay it sounds like the Labrador dog but it's beautiful it's got all sort of like um, scratches going through it and it's brown and it's going to yellow purple and you've got the face and that's the spirit in stone looks a bit like a landscape it's beautiful put it here and then you can watch it you've got number 29 the angels are with you so number 11 that is also a doorway so walk there's a new beginning like I said uh, earlier on it feels as if you've got a new beginning once you rejuvenate it okay okay so the angels are showing you showing you already a sign that they're with you and your luck was on your side doubly and now you've got the uh, the 11 number because 2 and 9 becomes 11 and Labradorite, that is a beautiful stone. The essential meaning of the stone is awakening to the magic within you. So if you think you're not create, you cannot be creative, like I, I, I told you right in the beginning, uh, you might be making something new out of something old. Then the luck and magic is here. It's telling you, it's showing you. Okay awakening to the magic within so after you have meditated or contemplated you're rested and you can think much clearer okay mystery and synchronicity help from unexpected sources the angels among others as we go about our healing work bringing love and light into the dark corners of our hearts and our lives we can forget that alongside reason of logic and logic is the very practical tool of magic. Do you think of magic that way? Or did you buy into the notion that the healing toolbox contains only what can be defined, tested, predicted and controlled by humans and their current technology? Labrador right spirit is here to tell you to believe in the mystery of how the conscious universe finds ways to support us in healing what is broken for its ways are magical you are being called to make a conscious choice to acknowledge the reality invisible to the senses 
that make itself known through meaningful coincidences. Pay attention to synchronicities bearing messages from the conscious universe which is eager to see you replace what you have lost and repair what has been frayed or broken listen to the part of you whispering that something small or seemingly insignificant has a great importance for it is speaking the truth the truth of magical synchronicities now this could be within a relationship or something within the home now we're going on to the relationship message this is a, a love relationship or just an, a partner relationship or a business partner relationship even or just um, an other form of relationship Labrador, Labrador right spirits message to you today is to be open to magic synchronicities so that you release your fears about love and open to it fully look for the signs that you are loved for they will reassure you that the conscious conscious universe is working with you to co-create the loving partnership you desire perhaps the relationship you are in has more potential than you think or perhaps it is an important opportunity that will prepare you for the one that y you truly deserve give up the need of certainty right now and instead leave room for magic and open yourself to the signs from the conscious universe pointing you to what you most need to know at this moment you desire that loving partnership you seek for yourself let the conscious universe help you co-create put it out there manifest it whilst you're um, taking time out meditating or contemplating make a visionary board now we've got a prosperity message as well that can be in business or generally in health as well logic reason and facts are important as you work to co-create the wealth that will support you in your quest to live according to your purpose and feel your interconnectedness with the universal consciousness that loves you even so do the not overlook the role of magic in creating what you need synchronicities abound the meaningful coincidences that you strongly sense are guiding you to think differently act differently and reconsider what your mind told you was the indisputable truth you are meant to prosper and the conscious universe is trying to help you enjoy a life free of fears about money abundance messages are being sent your way to ensure that you're aligned with aff uh, affluence and see it manifesting before your eyes be excited now for the conscious universe is eager to lead you where you need to go to experience the prosperity that belongs to you now you can do a meditation with the labra right right the labra door right by taking a, I'm holding it up so you can take a screenshot and you can print it or you can go to Google and find the stone labradorite uh, and wear it in your purse wear it in your pocket put it next to your bed and make sure that the energy of the labradorite stone comes to you and this is what you can do in a meditation you can hold it or put it on your lap whatever so that you can um, envision it and that you can manifest things with it I 
by holding it and getting the energy. Labradorite is a stone of magic that opens up our third eye and assists us in seeing the unseen. Meditation with this stone illuminates our darker aspects which once embraced and fully integrated often turn out to be our strengths. Labradorite protects the energy field and can be utilized in magical workings, shamanic journeys and as astral travel. This is also very good for intuition, not only the third eye. The third eye is spirituality, but it is to get another perspective. That is the message of your reading Libra. You can do it, but you have to have an other perspective on what you you believe. It's the reset button, boom. Okay. You can be creative. You can if you set your mind to it, you can do it. You need to take time out so that you can create an other perspective. Be more relaxed. Listen to your inner self. You are beautiful, Libra. And don't procrastinate. Don't weigh everything up and down. Just go in and take action after you've thought about it. Okay? I love this reading and I love the stone. It's absolutely gorgeous. So take that luck. That is your magic. You've got double luck here three times because the angels are with you. You've got 22 here and you've got 11 here. Again, two, conf two cards confirming that the angels are with you. Believe it. Feel it. Be open to it so, so that you can see the signs that they are sending you. I love you. Take care. Be blessed and stay safe. And I hope to see you in the life, if not in the next video. Please share and like with family and friends. Take care. Ciao, ciao.